Hey there, if you like to keep the title layer tidy, you can now hide the back and forward buttons. Before diving into how to hide these buttons, let's first understand what they are used for. The back and forward buttons are part of the navigation control feature. This feature allows you to quickly navigate through your editing history, such as recently edited files, positions within files where you've made changes or clicked. While these buttons can be useful, the navigation control feature works best when you use key binds instead of clicking the arrows. The default key binds on Windows are Alt and Left Arrow for going back and Alt and Right Arrow for going forward. On macOS, it is Control and Hyphen for going back and shift control hyphen for going forward. The best part, the keybinds will continue to work even if you hide the back and forward buttons. Let's now free up some screen space by hiding those buttons. There are three ways you can hide the buttons. You can right click anywhere in the title area and then uncheck the navigation controls label. The second way is to open the settings. Press down Control and Comma on Windows or Command and Comma on macOS. Or navigate to File, Preferences and then Settings. Now in the Settings search bar, look for Workbench Navigation Control and then toggle off this setting. The third way is to add the following line of code to the settings.json file. Workbench.navigationcontrol.enable and then set the value to false. And that's it. Now you have more screen space and you can navigate using the keybinds. If you enjoyed this video, consider checking out the other VS Code tutorials on this channel. Wishing you a wonderful day and I look forward to catching you in the next one.